Welcome back to my channel. Today we will be making uh, chicken enchiladas in mole sauce. So please stay tuned for this delicious recipe that you won't regret. And please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you for watching. Okay, for our enchiladas today, we are gonna be using, uh, okay, one pound of, um, of chicken. It does not matter, it can be um, chicken breast, regular chicken, and, uh, and the broth. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and save it because I'm gonna need about one cup and a half to make the enchilada sauce, okay? Okay, to make this um, this enchilada sauce, um, we are, I'm gonna call it mole. I'm gonna make a mole sauce to put on top of our um, enchiladas, okay? Um, voy a usar estos chiles para nuestra, nuestro mole que voy a hacer para las enchiladas. Y va a ser dos chiles negros, two black chiles. They, they, these they call them um, chiles negros, okay? Chiles negros. I'm gonna be using one chile um, cascabel, um, and I'm gonna be using three, three guajillos, okay, three guajillos. And we're gonna put them to boil, okay? Just like that, y los vamos a poner a hervir. Okay, um, right here, I, I'm cutting one large tomato into little small tiny pieces. Tengo un jitomate que estamos cortando en pedacitos. I'm gonna be using half an onion. Voy a estar usando mi, uh, la mitad de una cebolla. And I'm gonna be using um, half of a bell pepper as well. Voy a estar usando la mitad de un, um, de un, de un chile campana verde también para hacer uh, el, el, el pollo que vamos a cocinar para es lo que va a estar adentro de las enchiladas. So uh, we are gonna be using um, the bell pepper, onion, and, and tomato for our filling that we're gonna be adding into our enchilada. We are ready to add our veggies. Um, we're gonna add them in some um, olive oil. I put about maybe like two tablespoons. Uh, and we're gonna go ahead and add the onions and bell pepper first, okay? So we can let them, let it fry for uh, just few, like uh, maybe two minutes. Okay, um, ponemos aquí unas dos cucharadas de aceite de olivo. Y voy a freír primero la cebolla y la, el, el este chile de campana verde, okay? Primero antes de poner el jitomate. Okay, so we are gonna, we're not gonna add the tomato. Um, we're gonna add it after, okay? So we're gonna let this fry for a little bit. And uh, we are gonna go ahead and add half a teaspoon of um, black pepper. We're gonna add um, one teaspoon of um, garlic salt, maybe one, and, one teaspoon and a half, okay? Okay, because my chicken does not have any salt. And we're gonna mix the chicken with um, this all together. Okay, entonces le puse mitad, una mitad de cucharadita de, de este, pimienta negra. Le puse una cucharadita y media de, de sal con ajo. Y vamos a freír esto. Antes de, de poner este, el tomate que se fríe como, uno, como un minuto o dos, ok? Okay, so we are frying it for like a, uh, one minute or two. Okay, this is ready for us to start adding our tomato. Okay, ya está listo para empezar a poner el jitomate. So we're gonna start adding our tomato in and mix it all together. We're gonna mix it in all together, just like this. Ya le pusimos el jitomate y vamos a a lo más a, a que se fríe unos dos minutos, ok? Time to um, start adding our chicken in. Es tiempo de estar, en, de que vamos a empezar a poner el, el pollo ya, ok? Y lo vamos a revolver todo junto. And we're gonna mix it all, we're gonna mix it all in together, ok? Just like that. And I shredded this chicken after it was done, okay? So remember to shred it. And our filling for our enchiladas, mole enchiladas is, is done, okay? Just like that. Okay, this is gonna go inside the enchilada. Okay, uh, we're right here. We we have our clean chiles already. I put um, the negro chiles right here, and I put the guajillo in the cascabel, okay? The cascabel is just to give it a touch of uh, spiciness. That's it, okay? Okay, ya puse aquí los chiles en la licuadora. Están limpios y todo. Este, y ahora vamos a, okay, we, I'm gonna go ahead and put 
uh, 62 ounces of, of, um, of almonds. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and add that in the, in the chiles. I'm gonna go ahead and add, um, le puse una bolsita de 62 onzas de almendra a, a la licuadora. Um, and we are gonna put a half a teaspoon of cumin. Vamos a ponerle la mitad de cucharadita de comino. And we're gonna add one garlic clove only, okay? Because we are using a little, we are gonna be doing a, a small meal. I'm not gonna make a lot, okay? So, le pusimos un, un, un diente de, de clavo también. I'm gonna use uh, six, actually 12 ounces of chicken broth in, into your um, chili guajillo into our blender. Vamos a ocupar 12 onzas de, de este jugo de pollo pa, de caldo para ponerle al chile y vamos a moler, ok? Lo vamos a moler. And we are gonna start blending this. Y vamos a empezar a moler el chile. We're gonna add two tablespoons of olive oil. Vamos a agregar dos cucharadas de aceite de olivo. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna go ahead and strain our sauce into our pan. Vamos a, a este colar la salsa a la cazuela, okay? Así. Vamos a dejar que hierva. We're gonna let it and uh, let it boil, okay? Before we start using it. This is gonna be the sauce going on top of our enchiladas. Look at tamole. Looks delicious, doesn't it? You guys can add a little pinch of salt. Pueden usar un poquito de sal al mole. And we're just gonna let it boil now, okay? Before we turn it off. Y lo vamos a dejar a hervir hasta y luego ya lo pueden apagar. We are gonna start making our um, our cheese shells for us to make our, our our enchiladas. So this is the way, the same as we make the cheese tortillas, okay guys? Okay, vamos a empezar a hacer la tortilla para nuestra enchilada. Es igualito como haciendo una tortilla de queso, okay? So vamos a agarrar um, este queso. We are gonna get um, cheese with the tip of our fingers and then just put them in our pan like this. Okay, just like that. Put a little bit more, okay? There you go, like that. Our tortilla is ready, and how I showed you in my um, previous um, videos, we go ahead and pick it up from a corner and start doing this, okay? And um, okay, la tortilla ya está lista para hacernos enchilada, okay? So la ponemos en el plato. We go ahead and add our our chicken. Just like this. And just roll it up, okay? Okay, roll it up. Okay, our, our next tortilla, is, uh, cheese tortilla is ready. Nuestra siguiente tortilla está lista. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ooh. I know it, it looks kind of messy, but we gotta do this quick, okay, before it gets hard. Put our chicken in there as much as you want. Roll it up. You roll it up just like this. We are gonna go ahead and, and add our sauce, okay? Oh. We're gonna add our sauce. Our mole. We're gonna, vamos a, a poner nuestro mole. Just like that. We have our enchiladas ready. Tenemos nuestras enchiladas listas. We are gonna start um, adding our veggies and everything we're gonna add into our enchiladas. So I have lettuce, tomatoes, queso cotija, sour cream, and avocado, okay? Um, we're gonna go ahead and start with our lettuce. Okay, our lettuce. Our tomato, our sour cream, oh, our sour cream. I love a lot of sour cream. Okay, 
and our cheese and you could go ahead and add your your avocado on top our enchiladas the mole are ready let's try them now guys nuestras enchiladas de mole ya están listas vamos a probarlas ahora miren que deliciosas se miran el mole era el mole oh thick mole okay let's go ahead and try them now oh before I forgot, we have to add the sauce I made earlier. Tenemos que poner la salsa que hice anterior, ¿ok? Mmm. Vamos a probarlas ahora, ¿ok? Uh, uh. Ok. Mmm. Delicious. You just gotta try this recipe, it's so good. Mm, you can't even taste the cheese, it's really good. Mm -mm. Remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you for watching.